We reached 30,000 new bills in housing last year. The corner was turned last year. That went from 20,000 to 30,000 in one year, a massive increase in building in terms of new houses. The young buyers, the help to buy scheme, how many young people benefit that, first time buyers? 33,000. What was your position on that? You opposed it. And you talk in here then about helping young buyers and young purchasers? You opposed it. You opposed the first home scheme. You opposed the land development agency. You kept on opposing. And then, to make it worse, in local authorities around the country, you opposed housing schemes after housing schemes. You talk out of both sides of your mouth on this. And when it comes to the eviction ban, what did Owner Brin say? Where were they going to go next Christmas? What did Owner Brin say yesterday morning, Ireland? What did you say in the private member's uh, motion only recently? The, what did you say through the chair? You said the end of the year we should end it. Mm -hmm. In December. Christmas. Where is the honesty in that? Are you seriously suggesting that you guys in December would have allowed the rent to, uh, ban to be lifted? No, days after Christmas Day? That's the kind of dishonesty that I find reprehensible in terms of debating the housing crisis. Because it is a crisis. And why did we decide to lift the ban, Deputy? Because we do not want to make the situation worse. You, you spat out there. You spat out you're interested in the landlords. This morning I heard in Pat Kenny, Ono Brin saying, I talk to landlords all the time. The Tiger Daw Have syndrome. You're in here demonising landlords for the last three and four years. You want them out of the market. But then up, up comes your housing spokesperson. I'm a very reasonable man. I will talk to landlords. I'm even talking to developers. Pierre Stoherty will come in and say, you're all developer-led, you're corporate investment-led. I mean, the hypocrisy that spews out of what you're saying. But it has nothing Please, to do the, the with the reality no, the of delivering on the ground. So, Tony, the, sir, sir, listen, please, without interruption, without interruption from anyone. I th the, the bottom line here is, we need supply, supply, supply. That is the fundamental way to deal with this crisis. And in the context of the, the rental sector, we need to do two things. We need to attract more people into it. We do need more people to provide housing for rent. The rent eviction ban, if it was to continue for the next two years, and if we're honest, that's what we would have to do, not to next December, as you're pretending, because you know damn well it wouldn't be lifted in December. You'd have to go the full two years. Supply is the issue. It would, okay, I think, irreparably Tom damage Tom supply Tom to the rental market, which would be to the detriment of people who would end up homeless Grimaldi. and to the detriment of people seeking housing. Well, you. In your four-minute diatribe, yeah. what you didn't answer was the question I put to you, or the question that Mary Lou Macdonald put to the teacher yesterday. Where are these individuals going to go? Okay. Now, you may want to focus on me or Owner Brenner or whatever. I'm focusing on people like this a parent with two children where the Dublin Council has told them there is no emergency accommodation for them, available in this authority, where the Dublin Regional Homeless Executive has said there is no available accommodation in the county for their family size, where the local authority said there are no options, no vacancies in the hotel system, your constituents should present to their local Garda station for a safe place to stay or ask family or friends. And if it wasn't for the intervention of my colleague Mark Ward, that is exactly where that family would be, on the floor of a Garda station. Now, Tónishtí, this is before you made a cruel and heartless decision to lift the ban. There are thousands of evictions that will come live in the next number of weeks and months. I have a simple question for you. Where are they to go?